Hey guys, Swift here, and today I finally have the guide for you to uh, upgrade or change the RAM or the uh, hard drive of your Lenovo Y50. I believe I have promised to actually make a video guide as to how you can do that in my uh, display tutorial itself, how to change the display of the Lenovo Y50. I did mention that I will teach you how to change the RAM as well. Uh, it's pretty simple, except there's one thing that you want to take note of especially when removing the back case here which i made a mistake of and i actually broke uh, some of the clips inside i believe so hopefully you do not make the same mistake after you read this or watch this video so very simply you should have the correct size tools uh, there are tw uh, 12 screws in total that you want to uh, unscrew so they are all along the edges here one in the middle as well as you have two at the top here that you have to take off as well so once you take all these screws out what you're gonna do is that you're gonna slowly pry it open uh, from the bottom and then you realize that it will like clip open like that and you like clip out and then you realize that it's like the laptop doesn't open right it's like something's pulling it down now do not worry uh, because this is what's happened what's happening here is that this edge here it's like curved in so what you're gonna do is that you're gonna push out and then lift it up if you do not do that, you're going to like force it and then you're going to break some of the clips here, which I it which happened to me. So uh, hopefully you do not do that. So once you unscrew everything, which I've already done, uh, you want to um, push. As you can see, you're going to push out and then lift up the case, right, of your the, the back cover and you'll see the internal. So I'm just going to show you the, the part here I'm talking about. You can see here, it's a curve. So you have to push it out and then lift it up if not you're gonna break some of the clips that are here which i have unfortunately done so so once you you open it up what you're seeing here is the um internal of the laptop do not be intimidated there are only two things that you're gonna take note um that is more important for you and this it is the ram over here and then we have the hard drive over here very simply if you want to take off the hard drive you take off the screws over here as you can see here the screws here unscrew it and then you can lift it up and then of course the connector here you slowly push it out to uh, take out the hard drive and then you just do the same thing in reverse for your own hard drive uh, or ssd whichever as for ram it's very simple uh, you can see here this is an i am actually testing out some other ram from a notebook but uh yeah this is an ram all you have to do is to push open these clips which i'm going to show you right now so you push open it would pop out and then you can actually just slide or pull the ram out and there you go your ram is out then you just put in your new one there and then you're good to go same thing for the bottom you push the two pins here out and then you uh, pull out the ram you'll pop out and pull a ram just to take note if you're going to put it back in i'm just going to use back the same ram um you want to push it in like that first and once it slots in you just push it down there you go very simple very very simple hard drive same as well just take note of the connector uh, slowly push it out so that's about it really uh, there isn't much to say about the uh, uh, the upgrading of ram as well as the hard drive uh, if you want to change your batteries etc it is more difficult but that's not the video for today but yeah that's about it. Some in other interesting things that you want to take note. Your fans can be clean, actually. And uh, there are things such as, um, I believe this is the Wi-Fi. You can change it if you want, but no reason to. And yeah, that's about it. So uh, if you have any questions, do let me know. Um, I will try my best to answer. And uh, for those of you who are worried about, uh, electro about electrostatic, um, just ground yourself. What it means is that just touch like a, a metal part that links to the ground and then you're good to go uh, usually it, it if it wouldn't it wouldn't happen at least it never ever happens to me or you can wear one of those uh ele the elast anti-static band or something like that which i find no need of but you can get one of those if you are worried so once you're done changing everything you just put back the cover on uh, same thing just do it in reverse uh, so you're gonna go over the back and then you're gonna push it in um, and then you just screw everything in just like that yeah very simple 
So remember it's pushing out and then lifting up. If not, you're going to break some of the clips. So yeah, I'll see you guys again soon. Uh, any questions, let me know. Do subscribe, uh, comment and leave a like if you find this video uh, informative.